Hi, welcome back to our channel. I'm Sasha and I'm Nicola and today we're going to be doing a vlog of our Christmas preparations. We're going to be decorating our room, um, putting up some Christmas decorations, wrapping some gifts, doing some Christmas nails and making some Christmassy treats as well. We hope you guys enjoy watching this Christmas vlog and that it gets you into the festive spirit. Alright, so firstly we're going to decorate our room a little bit. Um, we've got some baby's breath in little vases that we're going to put around and we've got a bunch of mini Christmas trees and some other decorations. I bought this baby's breath at the florist. I'm going to put it in these little jars to decorate our house for Christmas. While we decorate, we're going to be listening to some Christmas music. Just put this Christmassy quote on this felt board of ours and I'm going to put it here in our bedroom. I think this is a really good spot for it. Alright, here's our little coffee table in our bedroom, all set up. I've got these three little Christmas trees and a candle and some baby's breath. So the next thing I'm going to put up is in this plastic bag, it's this white fluffy Christmas tree that I actually made a couple years ago and it was super simple but it still looks really cute so I'm just going to unwrap this. cute and fluffy and it actually still looks really good I think I just made it with like a piece of feather boa and then you just wrap that around like um, a cone of cardboard so I'm gonna put my tree up here I just need to move something she just fits only just it's actually very tight oh. So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to reorganize these hooks here because they have a bunch of stuff on them so I thought I would make them look festive and put some red and white coloured things up there to make it look cute and Christmassy. Thank you. 
Okay, so I've just put up these two really cute Christmassy dresses. They're both red and white and floral. Um, these might actually be like our Christmas outfits, but I just thought they would be cute there. The next decorating thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put up this big wreath on our front door. We've had this wreath for quite a while now and some of the bits are like falling off but overall it's still very cute so I'm going to put this up. Alright, so now that we've finished decorating our bedroom, we're going to make some Christmassy milkshakes. We're going to be making a mint choc chip milkshake, so hopefully it turns out good. We've got some chocolate sprinkles, ice cream and peppermint flavouring. Yeah. These are the ingredients that we have so far. So we've just got some peppermint extract um, and some chocolate sprinkles. We've got mini marshmallows and of course some chocolate milk powder. Um, and so we'll mix that with some milk and perhaps some ice cream and see what we get. So should we start with milk or ice cream? Actually, we should start with chocolate powder. Right? Yes. Thank you. Yes. By the way, we've never made a milkshake like this before, so we're not following a recipe, we're just making it up as we go. So hopefully it turns out okay, and if it does, we'll leave the ingredients and the recipe in the description so you can try it out too. Alright, so we're going to put a little bit of peppermint in now, so we'll get a nice, like, um, chalk mint flavour. Got to be careful. Okay. A tiny bit. We'll leave it at that because I feel like it could be quite overpowering. Time to blend! The ice cream is really... Now I'm going to add some mini marshmallows. and a few chocolate sprinkles. And to finish off, a metal straw to drink it with. All right, so we've just made our milkshake. Unfortunately, we only made enough for one because this is quite a big mug. But um, yeah, we're going Let's to have a little taste, taste now. We we'll go first. It doesn't smell that minty anymore. Oh. I like that. Mm, it's good. Oh my god. It tastes like the drinking a mint slice. Oh, yeah. It's actually a really good balance. Like it's enough chocolate and enough mint. Mm. I'm surprised though because I only put a tiny little bit of that mint mm. extract in here. So mm. be careful. It's very strong. It's super strong. But we've got like a tiny amount in it, so it's really good. That's delicious. It's so yeah. refreshing as well, like that minty freshness. And then the chocolate is really nice. Chocolate mint is the best. Mm. And we have some iced bojos to go with this. Um, and we might also go for a swim in a minute because it's getting a bit warm right now. So might jump in, cool off for a bit, light in the sun for a bit. It looks super nice outside. And then we've got a few gifts to wrap mm. and we'll show you all of our Christmas decorations and stuff when it goes dark as well with the lights. So it'll look really pretty. It's a warm day today so we're going to relax by the pool for a little bit.
So the next thing I'm going to do today is paint my nails. I'm going to do them with like a sparkly colour so that they're kind of festive themed. So I'll show you what shades I'm going to use once I've done my base coat. So I've just done my first layer of base coat so far and I think I'm going to paint my nails with this white diamonds colour which is like a goldy silver sparkle and then I'm also going to use Dear Sheer which is like a sheer pink colour. I'm going to wrap some Christmas presents right now while Nicola paints her nails. These are the three wrapping papers that I've chosen. There's this gold one with little white stars, and Santa print, and another very festive Christmassy pattern. Alright, these gifts are now all wrapped. Alright, we're going to make some eggnog now, but it's no eggnog. Here's the recipe that we're going to use. And two cups. So we've got nutmeg, ginger, and allspice. Cheers. Delicious. Cheers. 